All right, I'm going to read you the top five ugliest car brands known to man. Number one, Chrysler PT Cruiser. This car looks so cartoon-like. It looks so simple, but that's not what makes this car look ugly. What makes this car look ugly is the front end. What in the world is this? Maybe the creator of this vehicle worked as a dentist before, but decided, you know what? I don't want to become a dentist no more. I want to persuade in my career as making a car. And when he was designing his first car, he decided to add the feature to make the car look like it has teeth. Fuck out of here with that excuse of a car. F. Next we got Nissan Juke, which should be renamed to Nissan Joke because it's a joke. This car is a joke. Now this car would get at very least a C if it weren't for the front end of the car design. Like what kind of design is this? It looks like they took inspiration from the Chrysler, but instead of adding multiple teeth, they just made it look like it's smiling with a single tooth. F. All right, moving on. Nissan Cube. Lord have mercy, it's another Nissan Cube. This. This is why we can't have good things in life. It looks like the Nissan Cube was made from someone who discovered some old drawings of their childhood and stumbled across a car drawing and wondered, how can I convert this drawing into real life? And boom, that's how the Nissan Cube was born. End of the story. F! Now we have Ford Scorpio. Now for this car, I have mixed feelings about it. On one hand, it looks decent. It doesn't look attractive, yet it doesn't look hideous like the rest of them. It looks like a car for someone who just needs it to get to work or school. That I can understand. But on the other hand, the design and the structure of it looks lazy. It looks like it only needs a simple wind blow to tear down the car apart. I will say this, this car gets at least a D for effort. It doesn't look like the hideous Nissan joke. Now before we go into our last ugly car brand, I would like to make some honorable mentions. Alright, the last ugliest car brand is the Fiat Multipla. Look how goofy this car looks. It's like the company hired 5 year olds to help them design a car model and they came up with this shit and the executives were like it's perfect it's beautiful fuck that i mean why this what purpose does this feature have i honestly feel like this car uses more material than any other car brand and it's still not selling in the market and to those who own this car in real life go fix yourself like actually fix yourself Whew, finally we made it to the end of the review Anyways, make sure to like and subscribe, or you yourself get an F!